When the water changed color to brown and orange, your administration said the water was safe. When people reported rashes, hair loss, odor, and even sewage, your administration said the water was safe. When Legionnaire's disease began to infect and later kill numerous citizens, your administration said the water was safe. I'm a journalist. I'm just asking residents on this block if the state ever came to test your water. They told me they needed to go to the kitchen sink. That's where they went. They turned the water on, let it run for, like I said, like a minute, and collected their sample. Your results are interesting because 15 parts per billion is the limit. Um, so them telling you to let the water run for that long, that's probably why you were getting such low results. Mm. When they did it, do you remember if they turned the water on and took the sample right away or did they let it run they first? They let it run a while. They showed up at my door and they handed me a pamphlet and said, okay, it's safe to bathe in before they even went in my house. Have you had any problems health-wise since the water switch? Itching, breaking down, stuff like that. My teeth, yeah, so. And I've had pneumonia. I skin and I hear. I've been getting a lot of boils. Go ahead, get it. Right. Bro, I'm telling you. And I get them like, just, just, bro. Yeah. And they were worse. My daughter did have a miscarriage. He was at Heritage Manor, went to McLaren, where they had the Legionnaires. My father is dead. They want us out of here. They want to make it a college town, and we are not a fool. We know it. Go up and down the street. Look, look over there. We have a forest in the dadgum city. We can't drink our water. We can't go outside and play. We ain't got no parks. They're just going in, people who don't know EPA regulations, people that are older, people that are younger, people that are poor, whatever. And they're just right in front of them, cheating, to try and get a lower number. So who the hell knows what the real numbers are? You always hear that talking point, well, like 3,000 other cities have worse numbers than Flint. I think what we're getting at here is we probably don't know the real lead levels in Flint because they've been flushing out the lead before they test. <laughs>